Baseball is our nation's game. For years, it's garnered worldwide fame. It's been around a century and more. It's had its ups and downs for sure. The image wasn't always pure, but it's a game Americans adore. Now, starting from the early days, let's take a look and give some praise to baseball's countless heroes through the years. Let's give Cy Young the starting spot. His record is the best we've got. His pitching skill brought batters close to tears. But if you want to know the truth, there was no batter like Babe Ruth. His story is a legend in the sport. Lou Gehrig, Stan Musial were a cut above the usual. And certainly Ty Cobb, you can't sell short. Walter Johnson and Hank Aaron had careers by no means barren. And Ted Williams knew his way around a bat. And that Joe DiMaggio fella, he was also pretty stellar. Not to mention smooth Ken Griffey. How about that? Well, the game would be much duller if we had no men of color. Jackie Robinson's the champ who put things straight. Barry Bonds and Willie Mays and Clemente had his days. And Frank Robinson's prowess beyond debate. Home run battles are exciting, especially when the two guys fighting are as great as Roger Maris and the Mick. Then when Sosa and McGuire fought and never seemed to tire, it was PEDs that proved to be the trick. Sandy Koufax was a lefty, and his pitching stats were hefty, though arthritis made him quit while he was young. Then there's catcher Yogi Berra, though his English was a terror. In the Hall of Fame, his portrait has been hung. There were seasons full of scandal. It was pretty hard to handle. Guys like A-Rod and Pete Rose were hit with shame. Then the Astros stealing signs hit with penalties and fines, and it put a great big blot upon their fame. But let's get back to something sweeter, like Cal Ripken, Derek Jeter. Yeah, they both were undisputed shortstop stars. Carl Yastrzemski and George Brett were among the greats, you bet. Whitey Ford and Rod Carew both earned their bars. Don't forget Roy Campanella and that Willie Stargell fella, Reggie Jackson and the other Shoeless Joe. Johnny Bench and Nolan Ryan kept the horsehide spear a flying. And Bob Gibson also had the right to crow. Now, I wish I had more time. I could stay all day and rhyme. There are so darn many more that I could name. But in spite of every scandal, there's nothing we can't handle and we'll always love America's top game. Play ball! Yeah!